More than a billion people live in extreme poverty around the world. About 263 million children are not educated. 2.1 billion people live without the possibility to access drinking water and nearly half of the population in the world have difficulties to access essential care. 60% to 70% of urban households live in slums in Africa. According to international organizations, these figures and yield illustrate the sad reality in which humanity is stagnating today, despite the many initiatives undertaken in the direction of improving the general condition of peoples, thanks to a global mastery of issues related to sustainable development. IOED is a credible solution in the address of this socio-economic phenomena, hence an action plan in line with the vision of the founding state. This action plan is based on a structured organization focused on the missions assigned to the institution by the United Nations. IOED will therefore have to deploy regional intervention centers adapted to the specific needs of the target populations on the different continents to maximize the possibilities of success in achieving the Millennium Development Goals as set out in this document. Who is the founder of IOED, an emblematic figure of the organization, affectionately known as the Black Tiger of Africa? His Excellency Louis Kofi Lowry is coming from Ivory Coast, Executive President, Chairman of the Board of Governors of the International Organization for Economic Development IOAD. Louis Kofi Lowry is a person who saves the poor, the hope of the poor in the world, the African by whom poverty ended. After a fiery struggle and several pitfalls, IOED was born on May 31st. 2005 in Abidjan, in the Republic of Côte d'Ivoire. It is governed by international treaties concluded with several countries. At this level, the president does not give up. Designed to meet the global challenges in terms of achieving the Sustainable Development Goals and born of this commitment, His Excellency Louis Kofi Laure will develop an effective strategy of action aimed at meeting the ambitions of the state and the organization of the United Nations. United Nations as a world development institution, in accordance with the objectives of the United Nations Convention, signed on April 18, 1961, by which it is attached. Missions The United Nations missions to IOAD as a specialized intergovernmental organization provided for in Articles 53 and 67 of the United Nations Charter are available on the official United Nations website. The field of action of the IOED is part of a multi-regional context with ports of intervention in the regions of each continent by relying on strategies adapted to the priority needs of populations and state. It is so convinced of its seriousness and its capacity that the IOED was delegated by the United Nations a set of 134 public missions of sustainable development, mainly contained in the objectives of the Millennium for the Development, namely the establishment of a global partnership for development, the improvement of maternal health, the reduction of infant mortality, the promotion of gender equality and empowering women, the preservation of the environment, the reduction of extreme poverty and hunger, the eradication of high prevalence pandemics such as HIV, AIDS or malaria, the promotion access to education for all. IOED is also responsible for financing economic infrastructure projects such as roads, 
rehabilitation of public roads, motorways, bridges, airports, ports, dams of countries that cooperate through a headquarters agreement with the IOED. To carry out its housing policy for all, IOED has a real estate agency, RIO, responsible for funding of social economic housing programs and projects that act according to the needs of the population, the construction of emergency shelters during humanitarian crises or natural disasters. IOED also intervenes in humanitarian through its specialized branch, the Buka, Office in Charge of Humanitarian Affairs, which leads the fight to protect people victims of natural disasters and other similar scourges. IOED to solve adequately and efficiently the scourge of illegal immigration that is being fought against by Western countries due to various known reasons, economic, climate, or for problems related to security and conflicts that shake the regions, has set up the process of comprehensive treatment of this courage, which starts from the analysis of this courage of immigration to the hearing of the people concerned to the reintegration into this economic and social fabric in the host countries in collaboration with the government of those countries and also by supporting the return of immigrants to the countries of origin for those who are candidates for an integrated return to the economic and social fabric of their country favored by the IOED through a structured and well-managed funding that allows a guaranteed return of immigrants to their country. IOED intervened in the field of security and peace in the world through the MISEP, International Security Mission of the IOED for Peace, set up by IOED as an example of successful cooperation of IOED to help and strengthen peacekeeping efforts throughout the country with an intervention plan that targets the priority needs in this sense recommended by the United Nations. IOED also intervened at the request of the United Nations in the management of conflict in Africa. This action is supported in all the countries by its specialized organization in crisis management, peace and sustainable development called COPAD, peace and sustainable development committee, and finally for a comprehensive women's action, which has long been recognized as a key pillar of development and the backbone of families, IOED acts effectively through the RICAFED, network responsible for women's action and sustainable development. Therefore, effective action by IOED in its strategy of the process of sustainable development and peacekeeping as it has been recommended by the United Nations to ensure the sustainable development of the different communities. Description of the mission The International Organization for Economic Development, IOED, is an international institution of economic development attached to the state by headquarters agreement and to the United Nations through the United Nations Convention signed in Vienna between the state on April 18, 1961 on the diplomatic and consular relationships. IOED acts as an organism for international cooperation and aims at the economic and social development of states. Structure of the organization IOED has consultative and technical bodies whose functioning is permanent. These bodies were formed during the Constitutive General Assembly of November 11, 2005, held in Abidjan in Côte d'Ivoire. Central Bodies Advisory Bodies a forum of head of state and governors, a supervisory council, a board of governors, a board of directors, a committee of permanent representatives, technical management bodies. To ensure a coherent and effective functioning of its economic policy in the state, the IOED has a central commission made up of the following bodies. The President, 
His Excellency Kofi Lulaure, the Directive Council or Management Committee, the General Secretariat, High Commissioners and Commissariat for Development, the Permanent Delegations of the IOAD in the State, the Legal Commission, the General Control, the three main functions of the IOED. First, as an institution to finance development, IOED acts in all countries as a development finance agency. Second, as a technical development structure, IOED is responsible for the design of sustainable development projects and programs under the supervision of the expert of UNEX, a subsidiary structure that complements the action of the IOED. It is responsible for promoting global technical expertise. Third, the IOED is also an international cooperation body which has within it a protocol department responsible for presenting the IOED or the government, its guests, and vice versa. We present it in front via its regional headquarters at 21 and 23 Boulevard Haussmann Paris, 9th, 75 or 09 Paris. IOED source marks its presence in Europe. Since its effective start in 2005, the International Organization for Economic Development, IOED, with its prerogatives and its field of action act as a strategic partner for state, particularly those of the third world, in achieving the MDGs and SDGs. All these tools make it possible to establish a mark of confidence between the institution, its president, and the various target audiences of the IOAD. About the image to give to the IOAD, we can say IOAD. A new breeze for development or IOED, an avant-garde institution that has put poverty on its knees. Based in Côte d'Ivoire, where its headquarters are located, it will be a matter for the organization to support the state in their development process in order to make this economic transition viable and necessary in the current economic context oriented toward the inclusion of populations. These objectives can certainly be achieved thanks to the determination of the management team aware of the challenges and challenges facing the state in their economic and social transformation. IOED, the solution for a world in loss of growth.